Hey everybody, today we'll be taking a closer look at the Samsung Aluminum Studio Easel. Now, this easel is advertised as being virtually indestructible, which uh, leaves me with a lot of open-ended ways to prove it. So first we'll test some of those uh, everyday wear and tear type things, and then move on to some more extreme things if we can get to that point, and see if we can try to prove it. The first thing we're going to test is some of its more uh, everyday uh, classroom type use. I'm going to stack them together, I'm going to slam up and down a little bit and see if they still work. Let's see if it still works. Everything's fine and he's a world. I think we got to do something a little bit tougher. It's probably not a good idea. All right, now let's set it up and see if it's still working, okay? Still an easel. We're ready for our next test. Well, this is obviously the next progression. We'll check this out back in the studio. We have our easel after being freshly dragged through the parking lot. Let's see if the easel still works. Our knobs did uh, wear down pretty badly from the road. It's nice to know that the Samsung easel comes with two sets of additional hardware to replace them with, but I think we need to kick the impact up a notch. Now, I'm here uh, with our Samsung easel on top of a scissor lift, and we are going to be testing how it reacts when you drop it from different heights. Don't try this at home. Let's start with the first test. Seven feet to the ground. One, two, three. Well, let's make sure it's still usable. Still an easel. Let's drop it from a higher point. 14 feet. Doubling it might have been optimistic. Here we go. This is the same Samson easel. Let's hope for the best. Three, two, one. Oh, well, there's only some rubber caps. Let's see what actually happens. And one over here. All these pieces do are just cap onto the top here. Let's take it up all the way up to the top. We're at about 30 feet. This is not a safe distance. Everybody stand back. Three, two, one. Let's get down. <laughs> okay, well, it's still stand. I'm pretty impressed. I, I mean, we just basically dropped this from the equivalent of a three-story building and it's still functioning just fine. I want people to be satisfied that we're testing this under all circumstances. So in case somebody is painting on top of a three-story building, has the easel fully set up and it falls off, that, that will be the true test. Before we were just, you know, we were just being silly. So we're at the 30-foot mark. We've got our fully set up easel. Here we go. We're not messing around. Three, two, one. I don't really know what I was expecting. Let's see what the damage is. It's a yes, and the mask still works. I'm impressed. I, I really didn't think we'd be able to go this far. We were able to drop it from 30 feet, fully extended, upside down with a canvas on it, and it's still operating just fine. That, my friend, is a resilient little easel. We have proven, I think, very, very well that this is a nearly indestructible easel. So I hope it works out for you, and we'll see you again next time on Prove It. I miss the earth so much, I miss my wife, it's lonely out in space.